Hey guys, what's good? Rising Phoenix One. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, wherever you're at in the world. Oh boy, we've got a lot to cover today. So, first of all, Monthly Master is back starting tomorrow, November 1. This one is called Monthly Master New Beginnings, and it says, with the new season of NBA Live Mobile, we've made some changes to Monthly Master. This season, you will earn emblems exclusive to each monthly theme. From completing daily objectives and monthly master events, spend 60,000 of those emblems on offers, each with a chance at dropping the monthly master to be guaranteed a monthly master. This month's theme is new beginnings focused around players that have joined new teams this season. Start earning the three monthly masters today. All right, so we have three, not two, not one, but three monthly masters this year. For the month of November, we have Russell Westbrook, DeMar DeRozan, and Kyle Kuzma. Don't know if these are gonna be style select or if we're just going to have one in each game style the way it looks here right now. We'll be using the emblem system again. And it says, this season you will earn emblems exclusive to each monthly master theme. If I had to guess, that suggests to me that monthly master emblems will not carry over. Here we have a pretty familiar scene, other than the fact that there are three, not two monthly masters. And there's also a this date event that will earn you an 83 Bob Cousy with a little bit of that steampunk style going on. All of this looks very, very familiar. You can see that emblem spent goes all the way up to 180,000. So it looks like we're gonna be able to get all three monthly masters. And here are the monthly master milestones. What's important is that first 60,000 one, you see it is a select set where you will be able to select one of the three, Russell Westbrook, DeMar DeRozan, or Kyle Kuzma. Then again, at 120,000, you can select another. And at 180,000, you can select the third. So yeah, this all looks very cool to me and very familiar, but you know, with a new twist. So we're looking at the store now for the Monthly Masters. And again, this looks very familiar, except that they've added this key to unlock the This Date event and try to earn that steampunk Bob Cousy. Here's the rest of the store. And once again, this looks very familiar. We only know what is in these screenshots. So we don't know anything more then you're gonna know as soon as we get through all these screenshots. We do have the stats for the three monthly masters. So let's go to Russell Westbrook. For an 88 Westbrook, there's some pretty good primary stats. We'll go to the attributes now. Wow, these look really good. He's gonna be super fast. His inside offensive game looks great. His outside shooting looks good. And 83 point is not bad at all for Russell Westbrook. Defense looks good. Rebounding is insane for a point guard. And then on page two of the attributes, he's got a lot of good playmaking stats, really good box out. Moving on to DeMar DeRozan. Here's the primary stats and the attributes. His athletic stats on the left side are pretty much over the top. He's got a pretty good inside offensive game. His outside shooting is very good, except he has a 77-3. DeMar DeRozan is not really a three-point shooter. He's got great on-ball defense, nice steal and block, hands-on perimeter. So yeah, this is gonna be a good defensive small forward for you, who's gonna be able to go to the hole and also gonna be able to do a good job taking mid-ranges and that sort of thing. Not the card you're probably gonna be shooting threes with. Going on to Kyle Kuzma, no longer in a Lakers uniform. And here's the primary stats. His inside scoring looks crazy good. Going on to his attributes, uh, there's some fairly decent athletic stats. His rebounding looks good. His inside offensive game looks great. His outside shooting isn't much of anything, and it doesn't look like his defense is gonna be much either. Woo, but he has an 83 steal. Caught us off guard. Um, yeah, that's pretty much it for Kyle Kuzma. You know, while I appreciate that they gave us a little twist on Monthly Master, I'm not overly impressed with these card choices, I guess, but they are 88s. And so even if they're on the bench, they're gonna improve your team overall. And you never know, these, these cards might surprise me. We'll just have to wait and we'll just have to see, right? Okay, there's nothing else to talk about. Oh, 
you want live pass? Are you looking for live pass? Did you come here hoping we'd do live pass first? Let's go on to live pass. All right, here we go. Our first live pass premium path grandmaster of season six, a 90 overall strategic small forward, Jason Tatum. We don't have the stats for any of these cards. It will be style select, however. I'm super stoked though about this card. Jason Tatum cards are almost always really good cards. Live pass cards are almost always really good cards. You put those together. I'm hoping when we get to see the stats tomorrow that I'm gonna look at this one and go, oh yeah, yeah, this is one we have to have. So um, let's go ahead and move on to the rest that we have. All right, we're gonna go straight here because I know this is something a lot of you wanted to see. And what I see is live pass tickets and live pass tickets means we're gonna have ultimate live pass masters again. So everything looks very familiar which to me is a good thing. Keep live pass, don't mess with it, right? And the rest of the store, again, looks very, very familiar. So again, we don't have any of the particulars, any of the stats or anything for the masters, but this is the live pass style select. Don't know if this is the free to play path master or whether this is just a master that you get along the way. Uh, it's just unclear. We just don't know. I'm not going to guess anymore. I'm just going to get myself in trouble for guessing, right? Somebody's going to say, Rising Phoenix 1 said, no, I didn't. Rising Phoenix 1 is guessing. Really, all we know is somewhere in Live Pass, there's going to be a Style Select 86 Kyle Lowry. On the premium path, there is going to be an 86 AD Anthony Davis Style Select and that is very cool too. Oh, wait a minute. Okay, if you look all the way over to the right-hand side on the top, those are the milestones for the free-to-play path. And you can see there, along the way, there is an 86 style select master. So that means, and I'm still guessing, Kyle Lowry's gonna be up there, I think. And then along the way on the premium path, you're gonna have this Anthony Davis. That's what I'm guessing. All right, and also along the way, we're gonna get our first boosted court and we're gonna get a boosted jersey and there's no other information on these. I'm sure more shall be revealed tomorrow morning, but that's cool that they've kept that in there and we really need a boosted court. Looking forward to that. So, uh, you want to see the Ultimate Store Masters? So it looks like everything is remaining the same for the Ultimate Masters this month you can potentially get a 91 Jason Kidd. You can see they're all strategic. We don't know if that's the way it's gonna be. We don't know if they're gonna be style select. We just don't know. But here's what we do know. This month, if you do the premium path for Live Pass, you will have the opportunity anyway to get a 91 Jason Kidd. In December, a 93 AI, Allen Iverson, in January, a 95 Tim Duncan, and in February, a 97 Bill Russell. Now we do have screenshots of these cards. Let's take a look at them. Here's Jason Kidd, and his primary stats are looking pretty dope. His attributes really look good. Um, this looks to me like the best Jason Kidd card I've seen in this game. I mean, the fact that he has a 93 point, oh my gosh. Um, he's gonna be fast, he's gonna be agile, he's gonna be able to shoot, he's gonna be able to steal, and he's got great playmaking stats. This is gonna be a really nice card. How about December, Allen Iverson? Again, his primaries are looking pretty good. Wow, everything looks really good on here. I don't see any weak spots except for on-ball defense at 70, that's it. And then on the second page of the attributes, I mean, he's got good box out, he's got good steal, hands on perimeter, great playmaking stats. Yeah, this is gonna be a good card. January, 95, Tim Duncan. Once again, he's got some really good looking primary stats. As we go over to the attributes, I like his defense at 91, offensive and defensive, and his inside offensive game. He's got some nice outside shooting stats, but you know, he, they did him a little dirty on his three-point shot. 
Really good on-ball defense. Good offensive and defensive post presence. Yeah, that's Tim Duncan. And February brings us Bill Russell, a 97 overall. Primary stats are looking pretty good. Going right down to the offensive and defensive rebounding at 93s. That looks good. He's got some agility and some speed for a center. Great inside offensive game. No outside shooting, but that's no surprise. Really good on-ball defense. Really good block. Really good box out. Really good offensive and defensive post game. So we go to the ultimate store and this looks exactly the same and I'm perfectly fine with that. It worked. Keep it. And there you have it. So that's it for live pass. We're done. Thank goodness. That was a lot to get through, right? All right. We've got a new promo dropping tomorrow. Dia de los Muertos, Day of the Dead. We are celebrating the lives and careers of those who have passed on with NBA Live's very own Dia de los Muertos celebration. We will earn marigolds from playing events to advance through milestones. We will earn Alfinique tokens, Calavera tokens to advance Grandmaster Wilt Chamberlain to an 88 overall. Calavera are these um, decorated representations of skulls. You can see them on the bottom in the center of each of the cards. Okay, we can see from this shot that the events are going to be in the Live Today map. The one that's open here is Noche de Alteris, Night of Altars. There's five events. You can earn marigolds. It's unclear to me what the one next to it is, and I'm not even going to guess. You may have 10 events a day. You may have five events a day. We just don't know. But this is the general idea of how this one is going to work. In the store, um, we've got your typical starter pack set up. You'll be able to get the Afinike tokens as well as Marigold points. And if you're going to ask me, what about the Calavera tokens? I have no idea. We just don't know. You know, this, this is a very familiar store setup. And then we do have screenshots for the cards here. So this is Hal Greer. He's a six foot two point guard. Old school, right? He's got some interesting outside shooting stats though for an old school. Wow, he's got an 87-3. So how Greer played before there even was a three point shot in the NBA. And what I really think is cool is he was a good shooter and they gave him a good three point shot at 87. He's fast, man, he's really fast. So this card has some potential, not much on ball defense, not much on steal. Yeah, you know, this card looks a lot like a Kyrie Irving card, right? Let's go on to 86, John Havlicek. Um, you know, the primaries, I guess, are okay. Going on to the attributes. Um, you know, his outside shooting is good. Wow, he's got an 85-3. They're giving these old school guys decent three-point shots. I like that. I like that a lot. And he's got really good rebounding for a small forward. And yeah, those are the rest of the stats. Dia de los Muertos, Grand Master, Wilt Chamberlain. 87 primary rebounding. Wow. And those are some rebounding stats right there. 89 and 88, offensive and defensive. I don't even need to see anything else on this card. That's all I need to see. We'll take a look at the second page. 86 and 87, perfect box out for those rebounding stats. Oh, wow, yeah, um, this is gonna be a good card. Here's your rebounder. Okay, well, that's it. And yeah, I'm keeping my eye on the prize and the prize for me is a 90 live pass grandmaster, Jason Tatum. All right, guys, good luck with all this stuff. It's all dropping tomorrow. Tomorrow's gonna be Christmas day in NBA Live Mobile. Good luck with the new promo. Good luck with the existing promos. And yeah, that's it. We're done. It's over. There's no more. And remember, peace out.